Hello everyone and welcome to a new series called Retro Bowl. Now Retro Bowl is basically a football game. It's like Madden 1, but like retro style. This is a game that I'm really excited about because I love it. And I wanted to make a series on it. I'll explain the series throughout the video because today, because it's pretty long. Today we're going to only be going through the tutorial and I'm just going to be showing you how everything works. So, and I'll just talk about the series from there. So. Welcome to Retro Bowl. You're about to start your first season as the head coach of a pro football team. The path to success is an, an arduous one, but if you believe in yourself and can inspire your team, then glory awaits. First name. We're going to be Coach M.I.V. Our last name is going to be J. Doc. Can I put that as lowercase? Yes. Swag. Our favorite team. Okay. Now, obviously we're going to choose the Baltimore Ravens. That's my favorite team. Retro Bowl is a game all about building a legacy. If you choose to start with your favorite team, that's fine. But the story of your career will be a simple one. Why not start out at a low rank team and prove yourself as a head coach before receiving that dream offer from your favorite team? Uh, I'm good. With just one week left in the regular season, Baltimore has appointed MIV J Dog as their new head coach. J Dog has worked at the college level for several years and was excelling at the head coach of Nevada for taking the reins at Baltimore. Welcome to Baltimore. This is your home screen. You can tap on the division table to view divisions in the schedule when you're ready to play the F office button. Okay, so I'm going to go through the tutorial. So it starts you off as a with your team and they're doing terrible this season see 0 and 15 front office front office you can upgrade your facilities and staff tapping an eye icon to use on it so this training facilities stadium rehab facilities coaches and you can upgrade them three coins uh no season coming in anyways i'm sure you want to meet your players so let's check the roster screen these are your key players. You don't need to manage the entire team. Just take care of these guys and everyone will fall into line. Tap on a player to view his profile. You know what? Screw you. We're going to the running back. Here you can view your player details and attributes. Keep an eye on their morale and condition. Poor morale can lead to the game penalties and problems off the field. Low condition can lead to injury, worse fumbles. Not the best, guys. <laughs> That's not bad range. This is about like 40 yards. Before we head into game, let's go over the basics of controlling the field. Okay, first up, passing. Click and drag in the opposite direction. Okay, so I know how to do this. This is basically what the thing looks like. Drop the pass. Boom. Success. Nice. At the start of each play, you can hand the ball off to your running back by clicking on the blue circle. Use WRS to run. Okay. Go to the running back. Go up. We just have to stay. It's as simple as that. I don't even need to dodge. I don't know how to play this game anyways. Oh, my thing's stuck. Well done. You can also run with the quarterback. You do this by throwing the ball backwards. Dive. Finally kicking. Boom. It's good. That one's good too. Well done, you've taken charge of Baltimore near the end of a difficult season. Just enough time to get the hang of things before next season starts. The Baltimore fans are desperate for you to turn things around. Good luck. Okay, let's talk about what I want to do with this series before we get into our uh, first game. I basically want to do an episode with each team getting a win. We're getting a Retro Bowl, so it's like the Super Bowl. Okay, retro roll. Getting a win with every single team. There. Every single team. All 4, 8, 12, 16, 24, 28, 32, 36 teams. Now, each episode will be one team's retro roll journey. Now, obviously, they're going to be pretty long, so I'm only going to be recording such things as first downs, touchdowns. Uh, field goals, you know, like fumbles, stuff like that, stuff important stuff, not like one yard gains. 
So today I'm just going through the tutorial to get everything together, show you what it is, and we're going to start with Baltimore for the next season. But first off, Let's kill Cleveland. Cleveland is 8-7. and seven. We're 0-15. Oh Lamar Jackson is not playing too well. You're going to get the whole game for this one just because this video is going to be a, not the longest. So, oh, oh, dude, I'm so good at this game. This is a big play. Oh, ah, 58 yards. Make a 50-yard passing play. So you get achievements for stuff, and in the beginning, you get a bunch of... Uh, bunch of like achievements all at once okay Come on. Oh, stiff arm for seven so you're gonna see a bunch of achievements there's a ton of achievements i'll go over them after this game after i score a touchdown so there's a lot of achievements uh, we're gonna go for one each game is uh each quarter is two minutes I open tight end. Why is Lamar Jackson white? <laughs> the biggest question that anyone has ever asked is why is Lamar Jackson white? <gasps> Am I Trace McSorley, the absolute gold? Come on, man. Now, uh, you might be thinking, no, do I need to make this guy screw it? In your first, like, debut game, I'm pretty sure they don't score. So, we'll see next season. See, I just got an interception. I don't like reading all this stuff. It takes a lot of time. It's a bunch of pointless information. Well, it's not pointless. It's just I don't really care. I don't want to talk Touchdowns, 40% of the second quarter. And now, just this next point, though. Big play there. Longest pass air, 35, 30, 25, 20, 15. That's a touchdown. That's a touchdown. Trace McSorley, the goat. One more for two. Just come on with that achievement. One thirty-six left. So they punted. I pretty much. Uh, I pretty much don't really punt unless it's like fourth and twenty-six or something like that. You can also like. They're playing really bad, so I'm. I don't know, but you can also. I don't think you can get a safety. But the other team can. Come on, come on. Let's go. Oh, I didn't mean to hit my mic. I like the if, you, if you hit the post and it goes through, that's another achievement. And they fumbled. Bandit her out. Let's go, man. So, I also have four different kinds of ways I want to record um, different teams. I want to do one just like this, me, me commentating on my gameplay. I want to do another one where it's just me. Well, I could invite other people, whatever. It's me acting like a broadcaster. Pass for 300 yards. Win a game. Okay. Me as a broadcaster. And then there's two more that I'm going to try, but I don't know. Like, if it'll be the best. I'll do one where it's just gameplay. Like, there's no me talking. No commentary, whatever. And there's one where it's music. Like, just music behind it. And this does not matter to us. Buffalo won the Retro Bowl over New Orleans. Okay. So, that is pretty much the basics. Um, This is my coaching staff. I'm going to wait to continue... Let me Okay. Let me show you. So here okay. Here is all 
the achievements and I want to get all of these before I finish this series now I'm gonna do this video and since there's uh 32 I think it was hold on hold on 4 8 12 16 32 yep that's 32 so then I'm 32 teams and then I'm gonna do one finishing everything up so getting the getting the achievements I never got and that's pretty much it. I'm not going to do these every single day because that will overflow my channel with it. It's going to be every now and then. Maybe a double upload. But um, that's pretty much going to be it. I'd like to thank everyone for watching this video. If you, uh, if you did enjoy it, make sure you subscribe with post notifications. Again, I'm trying to post a lot because I am fairly new. And this has always been a trick of mine. Uh, hit the like button if you're excited for this series. Tell me what team you want me to do after Baltimore. After I get a retro bowl win with Baltimore, what team should I do after that? Because there's 31 picks. So that's going to be pretty much it. Uh, everyone have a great day, and see you next time.